I wanted to make some PVA solution and some borax solution for an upcoming project. So I'll show you how I made that in this video. For both solutions, I wanted to make 4% solution. So that means four grams of product in 100 milliliters of water. For the PVA solution, I'm using 40 grams of PVA powder. So divide that by four grams times by 100 mils of water. And that means I need a liter of water. To the pot, I've added the 40 grams of PVA powder to 900 mils of cold water. I've turned the stove on and heating the water up to 70 degrees Celsius. I didn't want to use a kitchen spatula, so I started off using the end of a paintbrush to stir it and then switched over to a whisk. It was much easier. I bought this PVA powder from a seller on Etsy and I'll put links to that in the description. After about 70 minutes, all the granules had dissolved. One thing you might want to note is that the border force might open up your parcel, which they did for me. So instead of having 100 grams of powder, I ended up with 91 grams of powder. So now I've taken a non-drinking container so that it doesn't get mixed up with any soft drink and marked the one litre mark on the container. I've got all the dissolved PVA solution and you can see that it's a little bit more viscous, a bit more gloopy than water. So I'll just pour that into the container and then add water to bring it up to the one litre mark. For the borax solution, I'm using 20 grams of powder. So if I divide that by 4 grams and multiply by the 100 mils, that gives me required 500 mils of water. The borax was just normal borax bought from the supermarket in the washing aisle. Again, I just add this to a non-drinking container and then add the 500 mils of cold water and then just shake to dissolve. Cheerio!